Yeah, playable cards. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Well, the three characters that it could technically do, the three characters would be no four. She wasn't within the Resident Evil 2 remake, which she was annoying. Yeah, depends on how you play it. But but yeah, it could do four people. It could do if he's doing it, it could do four people. Obviously Leon, Claire. What's his fucking name? Carlos, that's it, Carlos. And then the other dude. I forgot his name though. <laughs> That's her name. <laughs> but yeah, I forgot her name though, because it's. She. Well, she doesn't technically go into. Well, she does, but she's already dead. It's the thingy's daughter. Chief Iron's daughter. Right, what am I doing? But yeah, he's thingy. Because if he's doing the characters, if he actually full on does the characters as well for the map. It's going to be Leon, Claire. It's Leon, Claire, Carlos. And then it's the other dude that goes in with Carlos. I forgot his name. Also, Origin Survivor map. Crazy place coming in three days. Oh, sweet, sweet. Oh, yeah, so it's the whole thingy bit where the staffs are. No, Ada. No. Ada, don't go into the RPD. Or he could do... He could do... Well, she doesn't... I'm thinking of the remake, but... Um, he could do Jill. Because Jill, in the original... In the original Resident Evil. Your job is to escort the ACV while it oh yeah, Ada was in RE2 remake, but she wasn't at the RPD. Well, she was, but she was in the garage. Yes, she was in RE3. Yes, but this is when I've just remembered. Jill, that you're talking about... Um, RE, well, RE3 Remake, because RE3 Remake, Jill doesn't go into the RPD. But in the original Resident Evil, Jill, you do, when you're playing as Jill, you go into the RPD. That's in the original. In the original, Jill goes into the RPD, but... Um, oh, but in the remake, she doesn't. She goes into the sewers, but she doesn't go into the actual RPD itself. Because that's why I'm thinking, if he's doing it right, if, he's, if he actually does put the playable characters in, it, since it's the remake of 2, it will be Claire, Leon, Carlos, and then it's the other dude that goes in with Carlos. I forgot his name though. Because in the original. Because in the original, the dude that goes in with Carlos, he gets killed with. from a bomb. What am I saying? Fucking two? That's number three, you tit. Number three, yeah, Carlos is from number three, but... 
I'm getting confused, yeah. Because Resident Evil 2, the me, Jill, I mean, Claire and Leon, and they're off, they go to the RPD, because obviously that's where you mainly start. Resident Evil 3 remake, Carlos, when you're playing as Carlos, he goes into the RPD. Since well, that's when you find Marvin. That's when Marvin gets bit by Brad. And but within the re in the original version, Jill goes into the RPD. But in the remake she doesn't. But I just can't remember the dude that goes in the RPD with Carlos. I can't remember his name. Because it's the dude who jumps on the computer when you're playing when you're playing Resident Evil 3 Remake. It's the dude who jumps on the computer when you kill Brad outside. When you kill outside, when you kill Brad outside the door when you play Carlos. That's in the remake though. But in the original. He die, I'm pretty sure he dies by a bomb. And then Brad, you don't see Brad at the RPD. But you do. He's in the alleyway. He's in the alleyway that leads to the RPD. As a zombie. But obviously if you play the original RE3. But in the original RE3, Brad gets killed by Nemesis. That's the one thing I'm surprised they never did. Because that's another thing. People, you can just tell people that. Um, people like. There's like, you can tell when there's people that's played the original remakes. And they haven't played the originals. Because... Um... Because... A lot of people seem to think that, like, oh... Mr. X on Resident Evil 2 Remake... Is scary to be around and stuff. You can hear him running, like, walking around the RPD. Mate, you haven't seen nothing. they took they basically took the mechanic from Nemesis from the original RE3 and gave it to Mr. X because the way that they did Nemesis on Resident Evil 3 Remake is how Mr. X was on the original RE2 he only showed up Mr. X in the original RE2 he only showed up in certain places, like our Nemesis does on Free Remake. But in the original Free Remake, if you think Mr. X is bad, mate, you only play the original RE3, Nemesis, he follows you everywhere. And he doesn't walk neither, he full on sprints. He full on sprints to you. And he's got a rocket. Like he does in the room. Anyway. I am on site. Fletcher is with that convoy. They have a better receive this. We are trying to breach the anomaly with them. That's how you can tell if people haven't played the original, because the originals well the Resident Evil 3 remake, it's a good game, but it's bad as a remake. Is it's just bad as a remake. It's a good game, but it's a ba it's bad as a remake. Especially coming from Resident Evil 2 remake.
Especially coming from the Resident Evil 2 remake. Because the Resident Evil 2 remake's perfect. And it's like... It's probably got... Resident Evil 2 remake's probably got... What? Probably the best... Models... Slash mechanics for a zombie. The way that they react. You're shooting them. Body parts hanging off. Because they're more likely going to be remaking, re, re re remaking Resident Evil One. Since the fact of the new model, well, the new actress, I should say, for, for Jill. Since that they re, since they did a remake of Resident Evil One, which is without a doubt the best remake in the, on the planet. And then they're going to re remake it because. If the whole Resident Evil did being a new engine and whatnot. Plus the story's kind of changed as well. Because of the fact. The story plot. That's the other thing as well. The endings. The endings in Resident Evil. Well, no, it's in Resident Evil 1. Because the Resident Evil 1 remake. The endings. None of them are actually canon. Because the only re the only ones that, oh it keeps doing that lag. Um, the only endings that was the true was the canon ending was the, from the original one from the PlayStation One. But now since they brought out the whole new engine, Resident Evil Seven, Eight, Resident Evil Two remake, Resident Evil Three remake, they need to plus Resident Evil Four remake. They need to remake number one. But the one game that they need to remake first, they need to remake Code Veronica. Because Code Veronica, that's Claire's game. Since Resident Evil 4, since they've skipped like five games, and they've automatically just gone straight to 4 remake. They need to remake Resident Evil Code Veronica because that's Claire's game. So then Claire gets her own game as the new actress. And if they remake that first, which they should, which Capcom should, they remake that and then they remake Resident Evil 5. Because then Resident Evil Code Veronica since you get you see Wesker on Resident Evil 4 remake, which you do the in the original, but back in the original days you already know about Resident Evil 0, 1, 2, 3. Plus Outbreak. That's another thing. Outbreak. They need to redo Outbreak, but I don't think they will. But the way that they've done it with the remakes, it goes The Remake 2. The remade two, the remade three, and then the remade four. Because it's like the remakes of the remakes. Well, the, I mean, sorry, the remakes of Resident Evil One. That's just a remake of the game. It's just telling the story different, which it is. That's why I say it's like. A load of people say this. It's probably Resident Evil 1 Remake is guaranteed the best remake on the planet. That is perfect. It's literally got everything from the original game, but they've just added a lot of more stuff to it, which the stuff that they added was insane. But then... With the new... Ever since Resident Evil 7, since they added the new RE engine... Then they did Resident Evil 8. We've seen Chris. But. We've never seen Chris. as is, We haven't seen young Chris. In the new RE engine. So. 
that gives Capcom the opportunity to remake Code Veronica because Chris is in Code Veronica as well. And Wesker. But, like I was saying, in the originals, you already knew who Wesker was because you know who he is. But in the remakes, you don't know who Wesker is because you, you don't know the backstory of Wesker yet because Resident Evil 1 Remake doesn't take place within the new remakes, so they need to re-remake number one. They need to re-remake number one, but there is, there's like a load of speculation going around. There's rumours saying that Cat on a remake in Resident Evil 5, but yeah, it'd be cool to see Resident Evil 5 remade, because obviously Resident Evil 5 was a good game, but then... In a way, if they remake 5 first, it will just not make any sense. Since you see Wesker in 4, and then, this, and then literally in Resident Evil 5, yeah, Wesker's in it, but then... Wesker dies in 5. But then in Code Veronica, Code Veronica is set after Resident Evil 2 so obviously it gives you more of a backstory for Wesker and it, we'd be able to see Chris in the new RE engine and Claire gets her own game kind of like how uh, Leon did with Resident Evil 4 so then they can give the backstory for Wesker and then they can remake 5 which makes more sense. But if they remake 5 first, that just seems a bit off because of the fact of the backstory of Wesker. And Chris. Because we've just we've we've seen Chris in the new RE engine on Resident Evil 8, but we haven't seen him as young Chris in the new engine yet. Which would make sense. Because they didn't even add They didn't even add my boy Barry, neither. Objective that was the one thing I was genuinely, genuinely wishing for for Resident Evil 3 Remake, is that they actually added Barry, because Barry is in the original, well, Barry is in the original R Resident Evil 3, but he's only at the, in, like, at the end, he's literally in the ending. And it would have been generally the one thing that I really wanted to see was Barry in Resident Evil 3 remake but it doesn't make an appearance which is a bit which is a shame because the, in the original in the original Resident Evil 3 Barry is the one that picks Jill up Jill and, and Carlos up he comes in the helicopter He comes in the helicopter to pick him up. Because there's a lot of shit in Resident Evil 3 Remake that they caught from the original. A lot of shit. But yeah, that's just my opinion. That's what they, they'd be cool to, for them to do. They need to remake Code Veronica first. Or even just re-remake number one. So then we get to see Wesker. We get to see Wesker, Jill, Barry, Chris, Rebecca. Oh, what's his name? Because it's the other three. It's the other three. Richard, that's it. Get to see Richard. I don't remember the dude's name who gets killed by the crows. And then the dude who gets shot by Wesker. Enrico, that's his name. Enrico. I think it's Enrico. He's the dude who gets shot by Wesker.
So yeah, there's a lot of things that they need to do. But the only thing that keeps it, that generally brings it away is because of the the new movie, the new movie that they've done, the well the animated movie that takes place in Alcatraz. Kind of ironic, that isn't it? Takes place in fucking out on Alcatraz. But within that movie, they did the plot of Resident Evil Five within that movie. Since when you when they when they, they bump into Jill and then because even the thing he says. I can't remember if it was Chris or was it Is it Chris or Rebecca? Because they say that when she feels guilt she like she felt guilty because she got took taken over. And that's what that's what happens in Resident Evil 5. Because they could even go to the more the extreme. With the whole uh, DLC that they did for Resident Evil 5. The what the DLC when, when Jill and Clinton, Jill and Chris go back to the they go back to Fingy's mansion. They go back to the Resident Evil 1 mansion. Spencer's mansion. If that gives you the backstory to Resident Evil 5. But it's up to them what they want to do at the end of the day. But it would just make more sense for them to read me. Code Veronica first, then Resident Evil 5. Just because of the... Just because of the backstory for West of But the true true RE fans, the true true RE fans, the game that they want Capcom to remake is not what well, even not even remake, just remaster. Remaster Outbreak. Resident Evil Outbreak. Resident Evil Outbreak. A lot of people, a lot of RE fans want that. Resident Evil Outbreak. Maybe a remaster. I reckon it would be better for a remaster than a remake of Outbreak. I genuinely don't believe I shot three bullets at that dude literally with the barrel in his face and I missed This is the biggest problem with this gun. Shit for this situation. I 
I don't even think I'm even gonna kill her. I mean, kill him, sorry. Him or whatever it is. Because this gun sucks. Why the f Why is he gaining health? This is taking the piss. This gun's shit. It really is. This gun's absolutely disgusting. I'm just wasting time. Okay, I'll just get rid of it. Just wasting time with that. Marking contract. Well, this Resident Evil talk is actually a weird to play it. <laughs> yes. He's really put me in the mood to play him. I 
working, that's it. Because, yeah, if he puts him in, he could put Brutus and make make him like look like Mr. X and then, well, put that Mr. X skin on him or put Birkin on him. And then make the dogs uh, look as... We might even make it so you can be playing as Marvin. Because Marvin is in the RPG. Oh, so it is. I got I got my gun to level nineteen. I didn't realize. Wait, did he even pop up? Saying that I got his level nineteen. So I needed like you know I need like four more levels. Because of the Can you destroy the yeah, you can. You can destroy the decoys, so I need stuns. Unless if I throw it away, I throw it away from it and then shoot the zombies. So I might as well do, I might as well do this in the rear since it's here. This is probably the best way to get the kills. How the, how the hell does tier 2 zombies come all the way from tier 2? I still need to get zombie kills.
Deadbolt Actual, this is Dobbs. You may want to take a look at that weather report I just sent over. Seems like we've got something big in the works. Fleet calculated. Commencing navigation. So dark ether vortices have, uh, seeds. They spread primordial ether across the landscape. Simply put, that is bad. <laughs> This number quite over there. We could get just 
get my stones back. Did that seriously not get them because it was in between they say landed in between the gap on the floor? stuff I will. We'll go all the way over there just to get dead shot. Because I need dead shot. I'll go to this one instead. It's got a car in, plus there's this ammo patch. So, um, um, you'd be able to get the 45 kills with the stones. I was just about to say, imagine if I actually find dead shot with him. Or I might just. I'm just still gonna go over here anyway. Because it's right next to an X12 point. Plus. I get my hands on another dead shot.
the origin survival map that comes maps that's coming comes out Friday sweet that's why I don't text and drive where is this oh, it's, no, it's fine it still give me time to get everyone at base is safe strike team you're the ones in real danger here what 68 68 Let's bring some more zombies. Let's jump down here. There's seventy-seven. Need twenty five more shots. Should be able to get surely I can get 23 kills from zombies I stuck on the grenade. I was stuck on the Let's get that shot. Quite a lot of zombies around here. Where is he? Sure, the wrong one to tip. I'm gonna say, there's no way that didn't count. It's 60. Oh. I'm just gonna get this just in case. Again, four seconds. That stun affected the zombie in the dat in the bag, but it didn't affect the one that was like leashed here right next to it. I think, I 
think um, I think it's guaranteed for me to say that what's making my game life is this weapon. Say this is the only decent thing for this sniper is this. It's when there's just loads of zombies. And plus it doesn't help that I didn't triple pack it. Triple pack. Please tell me the game's not like full on crashed. No. Wait, did it even pop up? Got it though. Got gold. So sweet. <laughs> 